What is going on guys and welcome back to the Hobbyist Miner channel. This is going to be a short video today, but we got something fun in the mail. This is a kilowatt. Uh, this is a usage meter that I have seen floating around a lot in the crypto mining uh, scene on YouTube. And I thought we'd go ahead and put it to the test and see exactly what we're using. So if we come over uh, to um, our uh, miner screen here, and if you guys are running Hive OS, uh, you can load this up and then just type in miner and it'll go ahead and show this directly to you. Uh, but as of right now, we're using 635 watts consumed. Now, we are only on five cards. Unfortunately, if you guys watched my last video, we talked about the fact that we are down a card. So I'm still working on trying to figure that out. These are two extra cards now that we're trying to figure out. I may actually just resell these right now because of the current GPU market. I bought these about two weeks ago and the GPU market has spiked. These are both um, MSI uh, RX 970s. This one's an overclock. This one is not. They're four gig cards, but we'll have to see maybe resell them to a, uh, a gamer. But that in mind, we have a kilowatt meter, so I'm going to go ahead and see is what this reporting exactly what HiveOS is reporting for our usage. So I'm going to go ahead and kill the video real quick, and we're going to go ahead and plug this in and see exactly what we're using. Be right back. Alrighty guys, so I installed this really long, it's like a four foot, it's pretty much a four foot power strip, let's be honest here. Uh, is what we have in place. Um, I didn't hook up the monitor. I left that unplugged, but I hooked up our HP power supply and also our RT or our ATX power supply. So then here's our extension cord. I know nice and safe. And then it goes into that power strip. So right now you guys can see that we are currently at 0, 0.0 Watts. So we're not putting anything uh, through this at all. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to come up here. And we have everything unplugged. Let's go ahead and plug in our HP uh, power supply. It just went ahead and spun up for a second, but it's not actually on, like I haven't hit the power button. So as you can see, we're using 11.5 watts right now uh, on here, if it's gonna focus for me. There we go, okay. So now let's go ahead and plug in our ATX power supply. No spin up or anything like that. Let's take a look. 11.7, 11.8. Okay, so we're gonna power this on. Alrighty, we're gonna turn on our power supply. And now let's turn on our rig. Little power button over here. Maybe. Oh, maybe my switch is backwards. Let's take a look. Yep, there we go, fan's going. So now we're good to go. So we have no monitor right now. Well, let's take a look. We're now at 111 watts. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and come back in two minutes once we've given the entire rig about two minutes to go ahead and power up. So I'll be, wow, it's not, there we go. I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, so we are into uh, Hive OS right now. It's actually reporting 618 watts, so we're gonna base it off of that as our benchmark. Uh, we don't have a monitor hooked up, so if you're within a Hive OS, there's a really cool feature. Uh, if you click top right here, and then you hit Hive Shell Start, it sends a command directly to the actual system, and then you can go ahead and click here, and bam, check this out. All of a sudden, now we have console access. So once you're in here, you can go ahead and type in Miner, and hit Enter. And now we're actually seeing exactly what we'd see on the screen. So you do not have to have a screen hooked up uh, if, if you're not interested. So taking a look here, we're only at 12.3 mega hash right now, um, which is really kind of surprising. Um, so let's go ahead and go back here uh, and take a look. Uh, I do want to go ahead and refresh. I wonder why our mega hash is about one mega hash lower than normal. Um, we haven't changed anything at all here uh, regarding uh, any of our configuration, but we're here to talk about power. So 617 watts. So let's go ahead and jump over uh, to the kilometer uh, watt monitor and let's go ahead and see what it is saying right now. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and take a look. So it is saying... <laughs> 
hang on here. So it is saying here that we're using 1,089 watts right now, um, 1,092. So that's quite interesting uh, to say the least. Uh, definitely uh, some separation there. 9.47 amps, our volts are 116. So we're definitely seeing a big difference there um, on watts, you know, 1,092. Now, though, those numbers, my understanding is those numbers are not accounting for, you know, that's just what the GPUs are using, right? That's not accounting for like the power supply or our second power supply or our CPU right now or the motherboard running right now. So, you know, it's not, it's not accounting for anything on this bottom row. It's just accounting for everything up here is my understanding. So at the end of the day, that tells us right now we're mining Ravencoin at, what do we say, like 60 to, to 70 or 60 to 68 mega hash. Um, and we're right now at a thousand, let's say 95, is that a good average? 1,090, yeah, 95 I'd say, it's at the top there. 1095 watts uh, at our current rate right now so if you guys are now granted we are not doing any underclocking um, on our system at all so uh, right now uh, we're just getting this up and running uh, and then we're gonna really get into some more fine-tuning granted we have you know we're set at about 1100 and we're at 1950 for our, our memory clock but uh, my next goal is to start to work on you know uh, kind of taking these down a notch when it comes to power you know and the goal is is to get the least amount of power necessary to still get the most amount of mega hash available uh, that's the goal because then you're going ahead and you're making the most amount of you're, you're mining the most amount of coin um, for the least amount of money so that's our next step there well guys hopefully you enjoyed this short video going over using a uh, meter in order to take a look at your uh, power usage when you're going ahead and mining. I'll put a link down below to this kilowatt um, meter available for you guys on Amazon. And I don't do any type of the links that give me any cash or anything like that. Uh, I'm doing this for a hobby, not really for the money. So anyways, guys, thank you guys very much for joining me. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.